Hey guys, it's D, and welcome back to another video. Before I begin, I just want to say a huge thank you to all of my subscribers, all of my viewers for the likes and the comments. I really, really appreciate it. Now, as you could probably tell from the thumbnail of this video, we are doing another crystal vodka head alcohol unboxing showing. I'm super, super excited for these ones that I'm going to show you because they are part of my collector's edition. And so, yes, they are. And so, sorry, that was Sheldon. And so I'm super excited to show you these pieces because I've been looking forever for these pieces. And the fact that I have them now is just my collection is now complete. So before we waste any more time and let's get into it, I will show you the two new pieces that I got. I'm super, super excited. So this first one, it's June. So in honor of Pride Month, they only released this around Pride. It's the, oh my goodness, they packed this in good. It is the Pride Edition Skull Bottle. Now, actually, you guys, this is molded after someone's actual skull. Like, it's a live person, but they took the bone structure of someone's face and made this bottle. And I just, I love the colors. The purple, the blue, the green, yellow, orange to red. It's just absolutely perfect. It is, it's just absolutely perfect. Couldn't ask for anything better. Now, a friend of mine asked me, they were like, oh, what do they taste like? Are they all different? Because I do have the Aurora, the Onyx, the hand-painted John Alexander, this Pride one, the regular vodka, cre uh, clear vodka, and then I have the big, big one. It's in my other video. A link will be in the description below. This whole thing will be part of a playlist. Now, I do not know if they all taste different because I haven't opened them. These bottles are for collecting. They are not for drinking. So, uh, I don't know if they all taste different. No idea. And I don't intend to find out, although I would like to find out. So, we'll see. Now, this next one. Guys, I've been looking for ever for this. The last Crystal Head Skull Bottle video that I did was March of 2021, I believe. Yes. And so, since then, I have been looking, actually since before then, I've been looking for this specific bottle. And I couldn't find it anywhere, which is interesting. Couldn't find it anywhere in Canada, let me correct which is interesting because all of these are made on the east coast of Canada. So you would think that priority would be to sell them in Canada since they're made in Canada. No, they make them in Canada. They ship them to the U.S. or Europe or wherever. And then if you want them in Canada, you have to ship it back. Long story short, it took me forever to get this bottle forever to find this bottle but you guys I found it and when I tell you I'm in love with this I'm in love with this this is the bone white Halloween edition yes we are in June it's not Halloween that's how I was able to find it because it's not Halloween they are in high demand, it says so on the website. But like, this bottle is just absolutely amazing. And it comes with a little snippet I'm gonna read. Uh, limited edition bone bottle, distilled four times from the highest quality locally sourced Canadian corn. So it's Canadian. Uh, silky smooth with a hint of sweetness and vanilla. Her Micro Diamond Filter, I'm going H-E-R-K-I-M-E-R, -E don't know what that is, but okay. Uh, blended with pristine Newfoundland water. 
addictive, free, and gluten free. So Newfoundland, this is where these are made from. So with the bone white and the pride bottles, along with my hand painted John Alexander, the Onyx, the Aurora, it's at my collection is complete. I'm so thankful and grateful to be able to find these because let me tell you, it was took forever to find these. So the pride one, I found at the local liquor and wine and spirit store in Canada. Same with the Onyx, same with the Aurora, the John hand painted John Alexander one that took a little finessing. I had to look, I got actually the bone white and the John Alexander one from the same company in California. I'll put a link to their company below. However, getting the John Alexander one was easier to get into Canada than the bone white one, which was weird. Um, I think the whole, Thing, situation we're going that we're going through in 2020 2021 2022 has kind of put a damper on a lot of things uh i don't know if i can say that music or not however my collection is now complete and with this collection complete i do plan on doing something with the miniature ones that I think I have in my other video. They have like little 0.75 milliliter um, bottles, like shot amounts of the Crystal Skulls. You can get at the local store and they're like, I don't know, eight, ten dollars up here in Canada. So I do plan on doing a little DIY with the little ones so that once I get them all together and everything's done, it'll look absolutely amazing. Actually, something that they sent with the Bone White bottle is this Rebel Yell Ginger Whiskey. And let me tell you guys, I had this the other day. I saved the bottle, of course. Um, I had this the other day and it was really, really good. So I'm definitely gonna look for more of this. I don't even know if they sell it up here in Canada, but I will find out. Uh, yes, that will do it for this video, guys. Thank you so, so much. I will put a link to all of the bottles. I'll put a link to the sites where I got them, the prices, everything. I'll put the whole collection in the description below my other video which was from march of last year i'll link this is going to be part of a playlist because i you know i am collecting other skull like objects for my you know as part of my it's going to be part of my decor. and let me know if you have a favorite alcohol that you like or that you are thinking about collecting because I would love to know in the description below also I bought something for my sister as well because she is collecting alcohol different kind of alcohol different bottles than from me and so I found something that she can add to her collection that I know she will absolutely love so That'll be her birthday gift in a few weeks, months. And I think, I know she's going to absolutely love it. So uh, I can't wait to, I can't wait for her to share it with everyone. So uh, yeah, I'm super excited about that too. Thank you so, so much. I'll let you guys go to my next video. Uh, peace out. And I think I have another underwear video coming soon or a few. So stay tuned if you like underwear. And uh, that'll do it for this video, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, turn on the notification bell.